is the eyeglass icon the glass icon if you want your character to have a shade on if you want it to be a shade of red a frame of red rather whatever shade whatever frame you would like if you want to shade there's a shade here okay it's loading it's loading it's taking time if you want to shade you could shade of any color but i don't want my character to have a shade so i don't need it the next icon close to it is the cloth the clothes you want your character to wear there are, a, there are a variety of clothes here and please note these icons that have this shopping cart on them you have to pay to get them if you remember i said initially you register if you want to buy for instance if i want to buy this particular this particular clothes i will get to um i'll get to buy it from my already registered account you understand so we get to the, there's a variety of clothes here you can select you just click on it and allow it to load okay i want that to be looking hot <laughs> the next one is um, the trouser the pants you can select if you want to whatever kind of trouser you want whatever color they have short knickers here they have combat whatever let's just select um let's just select this one and also note that whatever dress you select whatever um trouser you select you could just change the color pattern here to whatever color you want the next would be the footwear the footwear you could select a boot you could select the slippers you could select a can just however you want it to be just customize the character to suit your taste okay i want that to be on high heels you allow it to do is it looking good is it looking good you could change the color whatever color you want you could just change it okay let's go with this one and the next icon close to it is um, you could add a voice if you want or you could just use the automated voice on it after that the next icon close to it is the, is the name you want to name your character let's just name this particular character princess yes Dawn. walking walking so yes that is how to use them um, that is how to use the Plutagon app to create customized characters. So having created, if you if you click on the icon now, you would see the particular character you created. If you want to create more character, you just go on and on and create as much character as you want on your script. It's always ideal to customize your own personal character and not just use the random characters there. So having created a character, you want to start your animation proper. Remember, you already have your scripts out. You get to click on the plot. You get to click on the create new plot. So yes, we have successfully created our first character. You can just go on and on and create as much character that suits your particular script. So that will be that on this particular course. On this particular topic right there. In the next topic, we'll be talking about creating your first animation how to use the basic icons while creating your first animation we'll be talking about character positioning we'll be, talk we'll be talking about setting your scene and the rest just stay tuned thank you so much for your time